In this video, we're going to be opening up the Dell Latitude E6510. Uh, what we want to do here is expose the uh, memory. We want basically taking out the memory of the uh, on this unit and uh, replacing it or actually moving it to a new system. So to begin, uh, what you want to do is remove the battery, which is over here. So basically you're going to push in the, uh, the two springs there and just release the battery. That's going to uh, expose this part here. That's perfectly fine. Um, basically what we want to do is remove all uh, power from this unit. So we've already unplugged it and now we've removed the battery. Um, you will see that there is no um, <clears throat> uh, screws to get into, let's say, the uh, wireless card and then another screw to get into the, um, into the memory slot. There is one single screw almost dead center in the unit. What we're going to do is we're going to uh, get a Phillips screwdriver and just release that screw. and. Um, that screw is spring-loaded, so as you release it, it will uh, basically pop up. Um, now this one here, we've replaced it, and we've just put a regular standard uh, screw here, I believe. Let's just have a look. Oh, no, that's a spring screw as well. So there you go. That's a spring screw. Uh, once you have it released and you can spring it, you're going to put some pressure down on the unit and just pull it towards you, and that will release this piece of metal. Um, uh, cover here. So you're going to put that aside. And that is going to then expose you to um, the unit. So we have here the hard drive, we have the memory, we've got the uh, the fan for where the CPU is, as well as the uh, optical drive. So these are the, uh, the memory uh, dims right here. So what we can do is just pop these out. Once you pop them out, they will be on a 45 degree angle. You can just simply slide those out on the side. Similarly with the one at the bottom, same thing. Now I will say that this, um, <clears throat> this again is the um, E6510. Now the memory that we have here is DDR3. These instructions are identical to uh, the Latitude series E6400 as well as 6500. The difference between those units and this one here in particular is uh, the other units, the 60, 64 and 65, use DDR2 memory versus DDR3. So you want to be aware of that when you're buying memory or replacing memory uh, for this unit or any other. Thank you for watching this video. If you like, please uh, like this video and subscribe. Thank you again for watching.